All right, so we've got a box of pristine hockey surprise bag. I don't even know what this was, seven bucks. It's got some cool, uh, it's got a cool label on it, some wrapping. Um, generally, you're not gonna get any value out of pristine though, so uh, this is just for fun. Grab this at 7-Eleven. We're gifted one of these also from 7-Eleven, the extreme value. Something tells me this is not gonna be extremely valuable, but let's see what's in them. To waste our time on this, we are going to have my good friend Eric narrating. This is the creme de la crop of gas station hockey cards. Yeah, okay, so we got Nathan McKinnon, obviously. That's a base card, and then we're gonna, oh. Is he actually... spear fishing in that? Is he spear fishing? Yes. Yes, he is. Yeah. That's... So that's probably, there. we've already hit extreme value. <laughs> On the back, we've got Braden Shen from this year. We got Zach Wierenski, SP Authentic Base. John Carlson, 1718 base. That's a nice close up. Samuel Gerard, 2021. Clark MacArthur, what year is this? It's gotta be like 1112? 1112. Man, I'm good. Clark MacArthur, 1112. There's your daily dose of Snipe City arrogance. Uh, Andrew Shaw. I do like looking at these older cards. Nice classic Mika Kiprasov. You got a 1516 Bergeron base. We got some old stuff, score 91. Wow. So for the user experience, we're going to fast forward and skip a lot of this because there was a lot of base cards. The downside is you will miss my long-winded Glenn Healy rant, so keep that in mind. Parish, honor, honor roll. roll. Wow. That's the extreme value right there. That is. <laughs> Alex Tangy, what is this? Private Stock Reserve Pacific, Alex Tangy. Base card, I imagine. We got some more classic score to remind you of your childhood. Zarly Zalapsky. Isn't that the greatest name you've ever that heard? Is. I remember being a kid and be like, that's my favorite name. All right, the Tom Barrasso. All right, I like that card. I always like Tom Barrasso. Scott Stevens, Pinnacle, Black. Alan Peterson. Brad Marchand from. I'll give you 20 bucks if you know where this set of cards come from. I couldn't tell you on Canadian Tire. Really? Opeachy Canadian Tire. Another Glenn Healy card. All right, so here's my rant on Glenn Healy because it's very difficult for me to keep this to myself. He sucked. Like, he was an average backup goaltender his entire career. He didn't do anything for the game. He wasn't very good. Then he becomes an analyst, and he just absolutely rips everyone a new one as if he was, like, the king of goaltending. Is that just me that feels that way? Like, Glenn Healy would just go off on absolutely everyone. Like, you sucked. Humble yourself. You sucked. That's my rant on Glenn Healy. All right, I'll take that. Little Patrick Law action there. Stu Barnes. Jan Herdina. Be a player. Steven Reinprecht, MVP prospects. All right, what else we got? Shani. That's a cool card. Brendan Shanahan, Young Stars. Bowman. How young are we talking? 1,028 games played. So not very young. No. Just about 11 seasons into his career. Tony Millett. i got to speed this up. Martin Broder. Oh, I love Broder. Another Kirk Muller. Wow, that was eight minutes and we got another stack. Wow. We'll edit down that eight minutes. From 1920, Adam Henrique. They're actually doing pretty good. There used to only be one newer base card on yeah. the end here. Now they've got like three or four. Um, we've got Dmitry Orlov, SP Authentic, Zach Wierenski. We've got Bo Horvat, 15, I don't know, 17, 18. What's on the back? we got James Reimer. Oh, nice. I don't know what game, okay, no, because this is about the same position he was in in 2013 when uh, Boston scored nine goals, yeah. to cup, not nine, but... No, it's seven, right? Something uh, crazy. It was like five. Five, five, four was the overtime win, and Reimer was on his belly a lot. Let's not, <laughs> let's not talk about that. That was a bad day. Nick Bonino, Stanley <clears throat> Cup champion Nick Bonino. Another Clark MacArthur. Is this like the exact same thing? Kevin Shattenkirk from... 13, 14, just a couple years into his career. We got another Mika Kiprasov. You'd think if they packed these in the same package, they wouldn't give you doubles of every card. Dave Ellett. The Big E? 
Eric Lindros. What is this, oh, like wow. a score rookie card? That's interesting. Eddie the Eagle. Topps Stadium Club, Bell 4. We've got Al McInnes. Another Bill Ranford with Gary Volk behind him. Stadium Club Gary Volk. Uh, what do we got here? Another Kirk Muller. There are so many duplicates. Jack, Jeff Brown. Another Jan Herdina. Be a player. Stu. It's literally the exact the same, same cards. Pack, yeah. Stu Barnes. This is not extreme value. This is not. Well, unless each pack is, and you get double the extreme value. Pavel Dimitra. Exactly. Rookie update, upper deck, Jocelyn Thibault. Is this like a legit rookie card? No, it's not. He's like nine seasons in. What are these? <laughs> It's just crudely drawn on with marker like a poo when you change the milk. <laughs> Tom Pricing. And um, this is not extreme value. No. We were told it was extreme value, but it's not. Not only do they rip you off, but they don't even let you pee in their washrooms anymore. 7-Eleven? Yeah, 7-Eleven in a nutshell. Bobby Clark. That's a cool looking card. Yeah, it's a drawing. You can take it. Pasternak. Uh, Sergey Fedorov, Premier 92-93, was his second or third year Fedorov. Third year Fedorov. Oh. Another Glenn Healy. They really know how to... Oh, Sidney Crosby, victory. That's cool. What year is this? 06-07. <clears throat> this is a second year Crosby victory card? This isn't half bad. But the way the market's going, get this thing graded, it'll probably be worth something. Really? Yeah. Uh, maybe. Probably not. I got a couple of victory rookies of Crosby. You do, yeah. I have seen them. Jeff O'Neill, Rosti Klesla, and Dimitri Kalinin. All right, that was a bit of a dud, but let's see what this guy is. This is the interesting one. They have it in this cool little packaging here. Not that anyone actually stayed through the first upwards of 10 minutes of this video, but if you did... Or if you were smart enough to fast forward it. Wow, look, oh, this wow. is interesting. It's actually packed and everything. There's a sealed pack on the back of score 91, bilingual. There's a regular snap holder for a 20 point card. This is the extreme value. It doesn't even say extreme value on it, so we're about to be really let down. We have a Superstars three card pack. I don't mind this. Put stuff in plastic and you'll. You've got to be intrigued. <laughs> a five card pack. And a 90s 12 original cards. Okay, no. I was like, what's original mean? It means just old cards. All right. Well, let's see. This pristine hockey pack. We've got Sergey Krivo Krasov. Great name. We got West Walls. We've got Thomas Sandstrom. This is not extreme value. We have Dominic Roos, Roussel. Sorry. Mike Madano, score 91. Was it second year Madano? Second year Mike Madano. No, third? Anyways, all right. Let's throw this out of the way. We got Yari Curry. Not bad. We got Fetisov. Wendell Clark is not punching him in the face in this picture, which is kind of a shame. Mike Vernon. The entire Vancouver Canucks roster, but all it is is... Who is that? 14 in the 90s. It's not Cliff Ronnie. He was... No. No idea who that is. Um... Paul Yeisebert, uh, Grant Fuhr, Ron Hextall. All right, next up we have our goalie five card pack. We know we've got a Tuukka Rask 1920 base card. Still no extreme value. A lot of... That's, that's where the superstar pack comes in. <laughs> a lot of junk we have to sort, but all right. Tuukka Rask base card. We got this little filler card here. We've got Anti Niemi base card. We got Don Beaupre. I think this is going way back. 
Look how small their equipment was. Cristobal Huey, SP Authentic. And Craig Anderson. All right, Superstar Pack. We've got a Lundquist SPA base card on the back. This isn't bad. They just put a bit of plastic around some stuff and threw in a bunch of base cards for $7. Not half bad. We've got a Brock Besser. Cool ice card. base. Just base, though. Can't even get a green ice. Like, give me a green. Give me something. We got a Mitch Marner artifacts base. All right, I'm sold. <laughs> Anything Mitch Marner, you got me sold. We'll put it at the back here next to his autograph. And we got Hendrik Lundqvist, SPA base. Classic 1991 score bilingual, still sealed. How much do you think you could get for that sealed? Nothing. Score was the junk of the junk. Oh. And 90s was the lax years. Donald Audette, Patrice Brisois. Mike Ricci, Ray Bork, Andy Moog, Moog, Wayne Gretzky, 1990-91 highlights his 700th career goal. That's cool. That is extreme value. We got the flower, Guy Lafleur. Each picture showing more of a receding headline, hairline. <laughs> we got Bob Kudelski. Bob Carpenter, Rick Zombo, Joey Kocher, Michael Pettit, Sergio Momesso. This guy again. How about that? He did do something. And Mike McPhee. Well, that's it for some oldies 7-Eleven repack cards. Thanks for watching.